Hey, Archer nurses. Happy Monday and time for your question of the week. This week, it's all about the different crutch gates. So if you have a client with episodes of vertigo and a fractured leg who's been ordered not to bear weight on the affected extremity, which of these crutch gates would you select? Two, three, four point, or the swing through gate? Pause here and choose your answer. B is the correct answer, that three point gate. Let's use one of our testing strategies to get to that correct answer, eliminating what we know is wrong first. You see that your client is ordered to not bear weight on that extremity. So you can eliminate any gate that requires partial weight bearing. You know the two and four point gate both require partial weight bearing. So eliminate A and C right off the bat. All right, now you're just left with the three point and the swing through gate. We know those can both work for partial and non weight bearing clients, but we know the swing through gate requires balance and coordination. The client has to actually be able to hold themselves on those crutches and swing through the affected extremity. Read the stem of the question again. You see that your client has episodes of vertigo. Do you think it would be very safe for them to balance and do a swing through gate? I don't think so. That's why B, three point gate, is the correct answer. All right, if you need a little more practice, Archer nurses, just head over to our website, archreview.com, where you can try a free demo of our question bank.